fresh homegrown vegetables from a friend's garden. With summer here, mornings and evenings are spent in the garden watering. And I just told Ramo we're not doing a video for the next couple of days. Then we get this very fresh spinach. And here's our spinach and corn pie. Which is sauteed spinach and corn in a white sauce and topped with creamed potato. For the pie, we have about a 300 gram of spinach, finely chopped. That's corn, a tiny onion, oil and salt. Here's how I got the corn off the cob. Cooked and I pulsed some of it. What do we have for the sauce? We have oil, ginger garlic crushed, a small little onion again. There's all purpose flour, salt, milk, a cube of cheese and chili flakes. So let's first saute the spinach and corn. First the onion. A little salt. And let it cook for a little. That's good. This is the spinach next. Give it a stir. And add the rest of the spinach. A little more salt. A splash of water. Turn the flame to medium, cover and let it cook for a bit. That's all it needs to cook. Here's the corn. Give it all a good stir and turn the flame off and move it to the pie dish. Let's make the sauce now. Oil's warmed. First the onions, the ginger garlic and a little salt and we want it to cook for a bit. The flames on medium, we tip in the flour and let it cook a little more. Yeah, that's good. Here's the milk. And you want to keep stirring till it thickens. That's good. The cheese. And the chili flakes. Here's what we have for the topping. That's boiled potatoes. There's warm milk, salt, pepper and butter. So we first mash the potatoes. It's nicely mashed. We drop in the butter. Salt. And pepper. And blend it all together. And a little warm milk. Let's mix the white sauce and spinach now. Let's taste for salt now. Even that little dash of salt makes a difference. Oh yeah, that's fine. And we top with the cream potato. The oven's warming at a 230 degree centigrade. We want to bake it for about 20 minutes and then turn to grill for 10 minutes. Our spinach and corn pie is done. Ramo made a pan-grilled garlic toast to go with it. Do give this very healthy and delicious dish a try over the weekend and I hope you enjoy it. Happy cooking! Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do comment, subscribe, share and click on the bell icon to receive notifications.